Hey everybody, Rundus342 here with another Warframe gameplay. And today we're going to be talking about two things, the Return of the Plague Star event, as well as the Tenelcon Digital Pack. We'll be starting off with the Tenelcon Digital Pack, and in that Digital Pack, it includes 370 Platinum, it includes the Tenelcon Armor Set, which has the Tenelcon Shoulders, Tenelcon Chest, and Tenelcon Feet Armor, all with the Lotus Crest in it. You also have a Barrow Katir Relay Key, which is a Tenelcon Relay Key. There, Barrow Katir will be selling everything he's ever sold. So that's a good opportunity to get stuff that you missed. I, for one, am missing a few things, and I'm looking forward to that. Such as Prime Target Cracker. I don't have that yet. I missed my chance, so I hope I can get it this time. Anyways, we also have the Tenelcon Glyph and the Tenelcon Sigil. That's also in the Tenelcon Digital Pack. That concludes the digital pack, and now let's move on to the Plague Star event. In the Plague Star event, it's the same as before, and the rewards are the same as before. But if you're new to it, this is what goes down in the Plague Star event. A comet has landed and crashed into the... Well, a comet has crashed, not landed. A comet has crashed into, into uh, the Plains of Eidolon, and that comet is an infestation. Boil. So a lot of infested monsters, well, infested enemies, however you want to depict them, are re reaping rampant in the plains and are getting close to Cetus, and it's a problem. So Konzo gives you a mission. It's your bounty at this point to get rid of them. How do you get rid of them? Well, you could get rid of them with toxic uh, cell cells that our good buddy Heck has been experimenting with. So this is what you do. You accept the quest, and then you go and find the infested cell. This is like a capsule, by the way. Um, you find it, you, you get it, and you complete the first first bounty of the quest. Once that's done, you're instantly notified to go to the next area, which is stage two. At this point, you're going to find a enemy vehicle, which is also a convoy. Um, you open it, and in there you'll have the defense pad. You int you click whatever you have to click to interact with the defense pad. Um, X if you're in PC or whatever button is for the consoles. I would not know. And you start your defense. It lasts a little bit, and it's just a standard defense mission. Once you succeed, you finish stage two. You move on to stage three. At stage three, you have to find a crashed Grenier drone, and you need to activate it. Once you activate the drone, it will lead you to the infested boil, and you need to defend that drone until you get to the boil. Once you're at the boil, the true quest begins, which is you defeating all the infested there and also defeating the Lafontes that spawn. Now depending on what you inject, well depending on what you get, you may or may not have to fight the Lafontes, but if you do fight the Lafontes you get more reputation points. Keep in mind, these reputation points are very very important, that you will need them to purchase blueprints and other rewards that are for this event. Now, where would you get these blueprints and rewards? Well, there's a mass child in Cetus itself, and that child has a reputation bar. Once you completely max out their reputation, which she only has three, three ranks, you can buy anything she sells. And keep in mind that once you you know, promote yourself to the next rep, you get one free item. And all the items she sells, it's pretty unique. You have the Plague Star... Um, emblem, the Plague Star emblem. You have the weapons, the Zaw weapons, the, they're the plagued weapons that you could craft. They're supposedly really good, so that's why I'm doing this event, to obtain those. And you could also obtain Forma and other type of resources, like minerals, from that child. And getting the rep isn't that hard, to be honest. If you're able to defeat the three Lefantis in that mission, you pretty much earn like 3,000 reputation points, and that's instantly an item. So it all depends how you do this. But that is the Plague Star event. Um, it's the same as last time, so if you didn't get everything like I didn't get everything, that was your chance to do it. Um, and one last thing before I end the video, I am currently recruiting uh, more members for my clan. The clan is still small, so if you're clanless and you're looking for a clan, uh, please apply. The description to the, the the link to the clan is in the description below. It'll bring you to the Warframe forums, and there just click apply. Now please note, you need to be clanless to join, because it's kind of pointless for you to join while you're in a clan. So please, only if you're clanless, apply to join, okay? 
um, please be able to you know be active so when I send you messages for questions you can reply back to because if you just apply and you don't ever go back to the forums I don't know if you're ever even gonna be playing so keep that in mind please but that's it for now thank you so much for watching I am run the street for two and I'll catch you guys in the next video